Normally, we use the Lightroom to do some adjustment and basic editing in our photo. But what if we have a distraction like this part? And I know we can use a spot go to remove part that we don't want inside the photo. But what if for this part, I wanted to have a more accurate selection and I feel like I wanted to use the content aware inside of Photoshop. I know we can like export the photo and then open back, save and open back inside of Photoshop. But there's actually a better way and faster way to do that. I'm going to just right click the photo and then go to edit in, edit in Adobe Photoshop CC 2019. And because my photo is in a raw format, which is CR2, so it's going to take a while because it's a big file. Now the Photoshop is opening the photo for me. And now uh, here we go, this is the photo. And I'm going to unlock the layer first so that I can do some selection. And I'm going to pick uh, the polygonal tool and then I'm going to make a selection, part that I want to remove or edit. Now I have my selection ready. I'm going to go to edit and then go to fill and then contents, make sure that I pick the content away. And then I'm going to click OK. So the Photoshop will do the magic for me by removing the part that I don't want inside my photo. And I'm going to deselect the part and I'm going to go to Command S or Control S or you can just save. And I'm going to open back my Lightroom and uh, see the Lightroom actually creating a virtual copy, a second copy for my original copy. So this is my initial copy with a distraction. And this is my second copy with a letter update. And it's a very non-destructive uh, workflow because you're still able to do some adjustment on the letter copy. And then you can uh, export like um, in normal way like you always export. So basically that's how you're able to do some editing from the Lightroom into the Photoshop without actually exporting. Uh -huh.